It's crunch time in the World Rallycross Championship. We are around 11 of 12 and we are at the Estering and this place is a fearsome rallycross track. It's the second oldest track on the World Championship circuit. It's been hosting international events since 1973. It's Lydon Hill that's older, if you're wondering, but this is a proper traditional rallycross track. It's 950 meters long. It's got one of the fastest straights. The back straight down there after turn one is 180 kilometers an hour, but it is turn one that this place is all about. Starts down there, it goes from five to four to three. And just when everybody's touching each other, it hits the gravel. We've seen some pretty incredible action up here. Remember, Solberg, the double world champion, had a terrible weekend out last time. He's had a terrible weekend here before. He's ended up in the wall hard over on that side. But Ekstrom, the championship leader, has also had his problems here. Last corner joker, absolutely fantastic for the race finishes. Very tight indeed, we'll talk about that in a moment. But remember, Ekstrom clipped the inside there. Because I think 2014 it was, he took the front right corner off the car on the way and very nearly didn't finish the race. This place is danger, and it also provides some absolutely fantastic close finishes. The closest one in Rallycross history, five thousandths of a second, that of course was between Ekstrom and Solberg. Absolutely brilliant finish. We had to go to a photo finish and the timing screens to see who had taken the win in that one. Now I've managed to find here with me Gigi Garli, a driver who's just returned. Hello, Gigi, Hello. great to have you back in the World Rallycross Championship. You, you came a, a year ago to, to Italy. What were your thoughts when you came about the level of the championship? I mean, uh, it's, uh, it's increasing a lot. Yeah. And uh, I saw from 2014 that it was uh, reasonable, the, the, the level, but now everything is uh, so tight. And as, uh, as my, my old um, uh, uh, teacher told me, now we have just to, to bang very precisely and uh, on the line to speak about tennis. Yeah, uh, sure, sure, yeah, sure. You have to, to be very precise and don't do any mistakes. Something that is not our, our, uh, our aim now because, uh, as you know, we've we just been on the championship, so uh, this for us is just a, a, a chance to, to see how this fantastic world is, is growing up. Now, what about your, your experience so far? You've said before you're a rally man, you know, on your own is fine, but, but five cars into one, particularly here with this Turn 1 here. How, how did you find Riga, racing up against everybody? That was, uh, was my, my, first, uh, my, my first match, because, uh, because in, uh, the, the test in Barcelona went uh, very well, but when you are uh, against uh, the other, you, you don't know anything. <laughs> Even because in this, uh, in this car, everything happened, I can ensure you that everything happened very quickly. So you don't have any time to, to think about it. So the experience uh, uh, makes a difference. Are you looking forward to Estering? I mean, I say this run to turn one is interesting. Yeah, I think, so we can see it just up yeah. there. What, what do you think it's going to take to be quick around this circuit? Uh, okay, as, uh, as I told you, experience and just, uh, just to be, uh, what can I say, able to stay uh, uh, um, out of the, of the trouble. And, uh, and, <laughs> and here we have uh, the, the first one. So <laughs> I'm, I'm quite worried about this, but uh, even so excited to, to be to be here to, 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 to do it. Well, it's great to have you back, Gigi. Thank you so much. We'll Thank wish you. you the best of luck for the rest of the weekend. Remember, Matthias Ekstrom has to leave here with a 30-point lead. At the minute, it's Christofferson, who's 27 points behind him. But this is the Estering. Anything can happen. Keep up with all the action all weekend, of course, the live stream, the broadcast on Sunday. The hashtag is WorldRx.